Rondo I'm in the wind, a million in chocolate chips And that's just how my cookie crumble I put a skirt on a whip and a crown on a six But there's no need to dress up the numbers, ayy What is good everybody, it is your boy from Everyday Trippin' back at it with yet another video today on the channel And this video is gonna be a hotel review As we're taking a trip down to Las Vegas To visit the wind this video is just one out of the several videos that we'll be dropping from my trip to Vegas. There's some already on the channel. I will link on screen to some of those if you're interested, and there will be more in the upcoming weeks, so make sure you're subscribed. You do not want to miss out. I had a good flight from California to Nevada to Atlanta, Vegas, about 30, 40 minutes, no turbulence. Had about five minutes of shut eye, hopped out the plane, went to the bathroom, got our bags, and we were greeted by Mark from Captain Ride Service. Mark's a cool, funny dude. He definitely recommended the win that we stayed at. He said he stayed there before, and he said that we were going to love it and we were in for a treat. Gotta love the folks from Captain. They're really cool, really funny, and they always take cool pictures of me, so I appreciate you guys for that as well. So this Capitol Grill right here, right across the street from where you're staying, I hear mm -hmm. it's really, really good. This is the well-known escalator system at the Encore that is located at the Wind right next door. These buildings are connected with a bridge, and this is just a little shot I got on foot for you guys. In case you guys haven't seen it, this is what it looks like. Although this is a Wynn Hotel review video, I did want to get a couple shots of the Encore because they are owned by the Wynn and they are connected right next to each other. And I also would like to share some pictures that I took outside by the waterfall and as well as inside the conservatory. There will be some videos of the waterfall and conservatory in the middle towards the end of the video, so make sure you guys are staying tuned for that. And of course, don't forget to drop a like on this video. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new or if you haven't subscribed already. Let's get into the hotel room at the Wynn. And here's the bathroom. We have the twin sinks and mirrors straight ahead with the tub and shower on the left hand side. And then the toilet is going to be on the right hand side. This is actually a very nice bathroom. One of the best that I've had while in Vegas. We have some necessities on the middle shelf right there for makeup and other things. And then we have a scale at the bottom, as well as a blow dryer on the bottom shelf. This bathtub is the showstopper for me. It definitely is one of the best tubs that I've been in. I would recommend going to the one just for the tub if you are a tub person or if you want to experience a really nice tub because it really is top of the line. Overall, great tub and great shower. The shower had really good water pressure, which is a plus. And of course, when you get out, you have his and hers robes hanging up waiting for you. I almost forgot to mention, with the necessities, they also will be providing a shower cap, lotion, and some shoe stuff if you're wearing some nice shoes or if you're a sneakerhead and you want to shine your shoes up a little bit.
One of the cool things about the rooms at the Wynn is they have an Alexa there. And one of the things that Alexa can do for you is open the curtains. All you have to do is say, hey Alexa, open the curtains. And voila, good job Alexa. You couldn't see much from our room because the big beautiful building known as the Encore was right smack dab in our face, but you could see a little bit of stuff on the right hand side as well as the left. At our stay, there was a golf tournament and Patrick Mahomes was there. I didn't see him, but I'm pretty sure I saw some of his cars he left in the front. So that was one of the cool things that happened when we were at our stay at the win. And those shoes on feet right there, the off-white blazer logo, I'll have a link on screen to that video of the unboxing. As well as a link to one of the videos that I recently dropped, sneaker shopping in Vegas at Urban Necessities and Sneak Garden. So if you're interested in that, don't be afraid to click those links on screen. Right about now. Ended off the night with using the tub. I actually got some bubble bath. I had to jump at the opportunity when I saw it. So I did just that. We did end up getting the room service and for some of the activities that we did do, there will be videos on my channel as I already stated, as well as some more dropping after this video in the upcoming weeks as I do weekly videos. But for the room service, we did get hash browns, we got sausage, bacon, eggs, and the acai bowl. The breakfast at the Win is fabulous. It is great room service. If you go to the Win, definitely treat yourself to some room service after some casino play. After we had some room service, we made our way downstairs and then we made our way to the conservatory.
gonna be pretty much it for the conservatory at the wind. Next up is gonna be some nighttime shots of the wind and of course some of those waterfall shots that I promised you guys towards the end of the video. But before we get into the waterfall shots, you guys remember what Drake said? Because if not, you're about to right now. And there goes a perfect shot of the wind and the encore. Now let's get into these waterfalls. Alright everybody, we're reaching the end of today's video. Thank you so much for making it to the end. Don't forget to drop a like on this video before you click off. And if you're interested in any other hotel reviews or any other Vegas stuff such as eateries, shopping, or even casino play, definitely make sure you are subscribed. There's going to be more hotel reviews, casino play, and definitely more eating on this channel. So make sure you guys are subscribed. That's going to be it from me in today's video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.